Okay, so this is part two of the uh, disk compositing series. Uh, part one, we we dealt with uh, pulling a, a junk mat and basic color key. So we're going to continue from that, but we're going to have things slightly different here. So right out of the gate, I'm just going to duplicate this layer twice and then go to the two layers below and delete all the effects that I put in. So basically the bottom two layers should be as original as they come. And uh, the reason for that is that I'm going to pull a key on the layer above and treat with the spill suppression on layers below. So let's turn both of them off, the layers below. So instead of going to final result in this area, we're going to go to intermediate result and we're going to deal with the spill suppression in the layers below. Turn the layer off and turn the bottom two layers on. Select the, the second layer and we're going to go under Effect, Color Correction, Channel Mixer. And this is a new way to deal with spill suppression that I just learned about a couple weeks ago. And uh, it's much better than just doing it in, in, inside of Key Light. So for the green red, you put 50, and green green, you go to zero. And then green blue, another 50. And this looks a little strange, but you just come here and change the blending mode to uh, darken. So basically that's the original layer, the, the layer below, spill suppressed. So now we just select the two layers here and layer precompose. And we're going to say that this is the original footage suppressed. Move all attributes into it. And now what we do different is here under track mat, you're going to select alpha mat, the layer above that's turned off. And uh, if you had a sequence of clips, you could just precompose that and do the same thing. So part three, we're going to deal with light wrapping and um, applying noise to the background layers.